Watch your RPDs. Lesson number 2 of 4. Rack phase difference. Maximum allowable RPD, and alarms. Content of lesson number 2 of 4. RPD limits of rig trainer 1. RPD alarm settings of rig trainer 1. How to jack within the RPD limits. Zero list and zero trim, to avoid RPD. Stomping, to avoid RPD. Reaming, to avoid RPD. Before we start with the lesson, disclaimer, the operations manual of your rig is telling you exactly what is the allowable RPD during jacking operations. You must jack your rig always within the allowable safe limits, this to avoid leg damage or total loss of the rig. The illustrations, and the numbers given during the course, are only for learning purposes. These numbers will always variate on each rig and each operation. Therefore you must study, and understand your rig's operational manual before any jacking operation can take place. Rig Move and Jacking Operations Masterclass Tailored courses, on demand, on board, anywhere in the world, recognized certification by the Nautical Institute London UK. The RPD limits of Rig Trainer 1. At Rig Trainer 1. Indication of a green light on the jacking console is telling us, that we are jacking with, an RPD lower than 35 mm. This is considered to be safe far within the RPD limits. At Rig Trainer 1. Indication of a yellow-orange light on the jacking console is telling us that we are jacking, with an RPD lower than 47 mm. This is still considered safe. But not preferable. At Rig Trainer 1. Indication of a red light on the jacking console is telling us that we are jacking, with a maximum RPD of 95 mm. This is considered not safe, and need to be avoided at all times. The jacking system, will block all jacking operations on that particular leg. Indication of a red light at the bow leg will only, block the bow leg to jack. However, it is possible to manage this RPD failure, with the other legs, as long as these legs are, still within the green or, yellow-orange limitations, lower than 95 mm. To avoid RPD whilst jacking legs down, and touching the seabed, make sure to always try to ballast the rig as close as possible to zero trim and zero list. This is considered to be very good practice to avoid high RPDs at the very beginning of the operations. Rig Move and Jacking Operations Masterclass. Tailored courses, on demand, on board, anywhere in the world, recognized certification by the Nautical Institute London UK. Rig Trainer 1. Has a possibility to jack each cord local to adjust RPDs. This is called. Single cord jacking. To jack a single cord. A strict procedure need to be followed. In lesson number one of four, 
we learned how to calculate the RPDs. RPD. The RPD math. Is RPV measured? A chord equals 40 millimeters. B chord equals 30 millimeters. And C. Chord equals 25 millimeters. RPD is the highest chord minus the lowest chord. This is face AC. 40 millimeters. Minus 25 millimeters. Equals 15 millimeters. This means that RPD occurs between the A and C chords face. 40 mm minus 25 mm equals 15 mm. And secondly, between the A and B chords face respectively 40 mm minus 30 mm equals 10 mm. Conclusion Whichever two chords measure, the greatest RPV values between them. Giving us the rack phase difference for that particular leg. This is how we log it on an DPD sheet. RPVA. Chord. RPVB. Chord. RPVC. Chord. Subtract the highest minus the lowest. The result is RPD1. Pause the video, after listening to the question please. Question. What is the color of the RPD indicator light, in case we have RPDs as shown on the sheet, red, yellow, orange or green? Consider your answer and start the video again please. The correct answer is. We are jacking with an RPD lower than 35 mm. The color must be green. Pause the video after listening to the question please. Question. Is it safe to proceed jacking having RPDs as shown on the sheet? Yes or no? The correct answer is. We are jacking with an RPD lower than 35 mm. The color is green. This is a very good RPD, to proceed operations. Therefore, yes. Pause the video after listening to the question please. Question. High RPD occurs at the bow leg. You want to solve this with single cord jacking. Is this the correct manner to do it? Yes or no? The correct answer is. Single core jacking is allowed only when a strict procedure is followed, additional info is required to proceed. Therefore the answer is, no. RPV slash RPD measurement sheet. Also available as auto calculating Excel sheet at your course library. If you are not engaged in our courses but want to have the sheet, subscribe to our YouTube channel and get it for free, just drop us a mail. Rig move and jacking operations masterclass.
tailored courses, on demand, on board, anywhere in the world, recognized certification by the Nautical Institute London UK. Nautical Institute, recognized training certificate, after successful completion, of rigged move and jacking operations master class. This was a complimentary lesson. Part of Lesson 2 of 4 and, part of the complete rigged move and jacking operations master class. To proceed and learn all about RPD management and get certified. Kindly contact us at the below email address please. Thank you very much. For your interest in our courses. And, please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, to make more free lessons possible. Subscribe, like, share, to our YouTube channel, to stay tuned with training and, the hottest job openings in the industry.